Good morning. Today's mass is offered for Sergeant William Wojtowicz. Kindly join in the entrance antiphon. It may be found on page 847 of the Missals. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the stronghold of my life. Whom should I dread? When those who do evil draw near, they stumble and fall. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. The grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and the communion of the Holy Spirit be with you all. Good morning. Good morning. We pray for one another today, asking God to increase our faith. Brethren, let us acknowledge our sins and so prepare ourselves to celebrate the sacred mystery. Lord have mercy. Christ have mercy. Lord have mercy. Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to life everlasting. Let us pray. O God, from whom all good things come, grant that we who call on you in our need. May at your prompting discern what is right, and by your guidance do it. Through our Lord Jesus Christ, the Son, who lives and reigns within the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. A reading from the first book of Kings. Ahab sent to all the children of Israel and had the prophets assemble on Mount Carmel. Elijah appeared to all the people and said, How long will you straddle the issue? If the Lord is God, follow him. If Baal, follow him. The people, however, did not answer him. So Elijah said to the people, I am the only surviving prophet of the Lord. And there are 450 prophets of Baal. Give us two young bulls. Let them choose one, cut it into pieces, and place it on the wood, but start no fire. I shall prepare the other and place it on the wood, but shall start no fire. You shall call on your gods, and I will call on the Lord." The God who answers with fire is God. All the people answered, Agreed. Elijah then said to the prophets of Baal, Choose one young bull and prepare it first, for there are more of you. Call upon your gods, but do not start the fire. Taking the young bull that was turned over to them, they prepared it and called on Baal from morning to noon saying, Answer us, Baal. And there was no sound and no one answering. And they hopped around the altar they had prepared. When it was noon, Elijah taunted them, Call louder, for he is a god, and may be meditating, or may have retired, or may be on a journey. Perhaps he is asleep and must be awakened. They called out louder and slashed themselves with swords and spears, as was their custom, until blood gushed over them. Noon passed, and they remained in a prophetic state until the time for offering sacrifice. But there was not a sound, no one answered, and no one was listening. Then Elijah said to all the people, Come here to me. When the people had done so, he repaired the altar of the Lord that had been destroyed. He took twelve stones for the number of tribes of the sons of Jacob, 
to whom the Lord had said, Your name shall be Israel. He built an altar in honor of the Lord with the stones and made a trench around the altar, large enough for two measures of grain. When he had arranged the wood, he cut up the young bull and laid it on the wood. Fill four jars with water, he said, and pour it over the burnt offering and over the wood. Do it again, he said, and they did it again. Do it a third time, he said, and they did it a third time. The water flowed around the altar and the trench was filled with the water. At the time for offering sacrifice, the prophet Elijah came forward and said, Lord, God of Abraham, Isaac, and Israel, let it be known this day that you are God in Israel and that I am your servant and have done all these things by your command. Answer me, Lord, answer me, that this people may know that you, Lord, are God and that you have brought them back to their senses. But the Lord's fire came down and consumed the burned offering, wood, stones, and dust, and it lapped up the water in the trench. Seeing this, all the people fell prostrate and said, The Lord is God, the Lord is God, the word of the Lord. The responsorial psalm, Keep me safe, O God, you are my hope. Keep me safe, O God, you are my hope. Keep me, O God, for in you I take refuge. I say to the Lord, my Lord, are you. Keep me safe, O God, you are my hope. They multiply their sorrows who court other gods. Blood libations to them I will not pour out. Nor will I take their names upon my lips. Keep me safe, O God, you are my hope. O Lord, my allotted portion and cup, you it is who hold fast my lot. I set the Lord over ever before me. With him at my right hand, I shall not be disturbed. Keep me safe, O God, you are my hope. You will show me the path to life fullness of joys in your presence, the delights at your right hand forever. Keep me safe, O God, you are my hope. Hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. Teach me your path, my God, and guide me in your truth. Hallelujah, Hallelujah, Hallelujah. The Lord be with you. <clears throat> A reading from the Holy Gospel according to Matthew. <clears throat> Excuse me. <clears throat> Jesus said to his disciples, <clears throat> Do not think that I have come to abolish the law or the prophets. I have not come to abolish, but to fulfill. Amen, I say to you, until heaven and earth pass away, not the smallest letter of the smallest part of a letter will pass from the Lord, until all things have taken place. Therefore, whoever breaks one of the least of these commandments and teaches others to do so, we be called the least in the kingdom of heaven. But whoever obeys and teaches these commandments, we be called the greatest in the kingdom of heaven. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise 
Let us pray. Christ will be saved yesterday, today, and forever. For he loved us, but also taught us to believe in him. In confidence, may our faith grow as we commune with him this morning. We pray for the Lord. Lord hear our Lord. Hear our for the prophetic church, the voice of Christ in the world, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. For honest leaders who attend to the good of all, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, Lord hear our prayer. 
For hopeful families who raise children in difficult circumstances, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For those who make peace with quiet patience and cheerful persistence, let us pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For all gathered here who seek holiness in everyday life, let us pray to the Lord. And for Sergeant William Wojtowicz, for whom this Mass is offered, let us pray to the Lord. Lord if there are other intentions, we will want to include, do so now. <coughs> Merciful Father, thank you for loving us. May we continue to feel your presence, even at the difficult times, for you live and reign forever and ever. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God of our creation, for you have blessed and received the bread we all find. Fruit of the earth and what of human hands is become for us the bread of life. Blessed be God of the earth. Blessed be God Blessed are you, Lord God of our creation, for you have blessed and received the wine we all find. Fruit of wine and the work of human hands, it will become our spiritual bread. Blessed be God of the To the right and just are the tender of salvation, always and everywhere, to give you thanks, Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God. For in goodness you created men, and when he was justly condemned in mercy, you redeemed him through Christ our Lord. Through him the angels praise your majesty. Dominions are those and power trouble before you. Heaven and the virtues of heaven. And the blessed seraph and worship together with our exaltation. May our voices will pray down with ears in humble prayer as we are glad. Thank you. 
means we pray by sending down your spirit upon them like they do fall, so that they may be comfort. The body and blood of the Son, our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time of the betrayer entered willingly into his passion, he took bread and gave it to the thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you are here of it. For this is my body, which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when Saul Powell landed, he took the chalice, once more giving you thanks, gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it. For this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which should be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory. The mystery of faith. We proclaim you your name, Lord, and the Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of the death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life, chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you help us for all to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that, partaking of the body and blood of Christ, we may be guided and be formed by the Holy Spirit. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world. Bring out the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, and Notion, our Bishop, in all their faith. Remember our brothers and sisters who find us living in the hope of the resurrection and all of dying in your mercy. Where can the name of your faith? Have mercy on us all we pray. That with the blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, the blessed apostles and all the saints who please you throughout our ages, we may marry to be God is eternal life and the praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him and with him and in him, O God Almighty Father, in the name of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At Savior's command, and from that time, we dare to say, Deliver us, Lord, we pray for that we give up. Graciously grant us peace in our days. Your mercy keep us free from sin and protect us from all distress, as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to the apostles, I give you peace, my peace I give unto you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant our peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. Let us offer to each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, we take away the sins of the world of mercy. Lamb of God, we take away the sins of the world. Behold the Lamb of God, behold him who takes.
takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those who are part of the suffering of the land. Pardon me, I don't know if you should enter into my youth, but when I say the word, I'm going to say the word. Let the body and blood of Christ keep us safe unto everlasting life. Amen. Please join in the communion antiphon on page 847. The Lord is my rock, my fortress, and my deliverer. My God is my saving strength. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all majesty, ye are the Lord of God. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all majesty, ye are the Lord of God. O sacrament most holy, O sacrament divine, all praise and all majesty, ye are the Lord of God. Let us pray. May your healing word, O Lord, free us with prayer from doing evil, and lead us to what is right, through Christ our Lord. Amen. I'll be driving to New York this morning. We'll be having a meeting with my bishop, who is visiting from Nigeria with all our priests in the United States. So, um, I wouldn't have time like doing all our little talking. So once I'm done, I'm gonna drive back. So don't feel something is wrong now. But I wanna meet up. Okay. So thank you. I remember also your prayers. The Lord be with you. Yes, Almighty God bless you, the Father, the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen.